All right, so in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to install sound fonts to LMMS. Um, the pre-built piano in this software is a great example of how terrible the pre-built packs are. The notes aren't even the right notes. So we're going to fix that. We're going to close out LMMS. And we're going to go to schristiancollins.com, which I will link in the description. This is what you'll see when you get to the main page. And then you want to go to Virtual Instruments. And then you want to go over to the left and click on General User GS. It is a very high quality library that you can get for um, LMMS. Okay? So. You're going to go down here to the download and you're going to grab that file. Okay. And you're going to want to make sure you have your folder open to the packs, the correct location. So mine's in the C drive, program files, LMMS, and then data and then samples. So in this samples folder is where you're going to extract this other file. Okay, so let's go back to that. I've got both of my folders open. I'm going to, here's what I'll do. I'll just drag this over here and I'm just going to extract it. Let's do this. We'll go to extract and then we'll browse to it. I don't know why that didn't work, but that's you want to put it in the samples folder. That's really all I'm getting at here. That is where it goes. OK, select that folder. OK. Now you can see that in the samples folder, you'll see general user GS 1.471. Now let's go back to LMMS. You can't really say that very quickly. It sounds kind of weird. And now we're going to go to the little musical note, my samples. And now you can see general user GS is in there. And you're just going to drag this over. And this is it. Okay, so now you got a much nicer sounding piano. And if you click on the little tool icon, you can change the instrument. And there's these banks, okay? The banks on the left are just different banks of things, okay? And then zero is just where most of your instruments are, okay? Let's pick the banjo. I'm using my keyboard there, my computer keyboard to play that. But you can see that's a much nicer sounding pack. And um, I'm not sure if you can delete these other files in the general user folder, but I'll leave you up to that. I just leave it in there. I have my general user folder and I know I can just need to drag this over and you can have multiple ones. Um, and then each one that you have, you can change to a different instrument. see they sound much nicer. Now um, I don't know in the keyboard shortcuts with this program yet but I'll probably do a few more videos. I'm really just a beginner at this program but that's the first thing that you are gonna want to do when you install LMMS on your computer and uh, yeah that's it that's the video that's how you're gonna put your new sound fonts on.